What is up my little gremlins? Today we are reacting to episode 10 to 11 of Bungo Stray Dogs because this season actually has an extra episode. So it's not 12 episodes, it's 13, which kind of poopy for my organization, but it's fine. Cause I was really enjoying doing three episodes of video, but it is what it is, I'll suffer. It's fine. I'm not mad about it, you're mad about it. But I'm excited to watch today's episode and kind of see what happens with the guild and if the Port Mafia and the secret group get to just <laughs> you know? I don't know why that sounded like a car i'm not i was trying to and if you guys would like to see my videos and time reactions or more and kind of join our community and support the channel you can check out my patreon below and yeah without further ado let's get into it look it's a heart just for you what the fuck why would they challenge rampo how old is rampo It's been a long time. He's 26. Valid. He's sexy. Yeah, literally. Who is that? What the fuck? Like Edgar Allan Poe? Literally, who is that? My man looks like a darker haired light Yagami. Damn, this man. <laughs> Jesus. He likes to just be. He just likes to be. He just likes to be, like, complimented. Same. I'm running. This is your brain on ADHD. Coming from one of the rooms. What is his ability to put them in the book? Shut up. That's it. I am Rampo. I am the detective now. My man is forcing them to play a game of Cluedo. <laughs> it's literally Cluedo. Who killed who with what weapon in what room? My man's in an escape room. <gasps> His glasses. Welcome to the locked realm. So technically, if he doesn't catch the killer in the story, he will actually die. Does he really think that he needs that? This is all self-fulfilling prophecy that he's convinced himself that he needs them because it doesn't he doesn't have a gift. Rampo, come on. Yeah. Rampo, get your shit together, you little bitch. We got shit to do! Well bred young lady. I don't like that. What is she, submissive and breedable bitch? What is she, a fucking cow? Yeah, because somebody as poised as you would probably be chopping wood in the kitchen. Then where would the string be, dumbass? Oh, never mind. Has he convinced himself so deeply that he's gifted because he wanted to fit in, that he developed this skill, that he refuses to use it as a result? He's probably gonna figure it out and then be really upset about it after, isn't he? Damn, that's a bit dramatic. Does she die? Oh, 
ランポさんが才能を生かす安定者に誘ってくれたこと。Oh, is she gonna use, is he gonna use her glasses? That's it. Done. Easy. Sorted. Was him? Tall space elevator? She is truly a member of the agency. You're just gonna have to convince her with Atsushi to bring her back in the light, sir. Bro, I keep thinking his mole is like remnant food or something. I don't know why. Like, I literally have one. I mean, do you fucking blame her? That's how she was raised. Micro assault? Why just with him, though? That's a lot of responsibility. Jesus Christ. Who is this man? And why does he plague him so much? Leave him alone. Is that the only fucking move that he has? Light snow? Because I haven't seen him do anything else. Aktagawa. My man is coughing up some diseases to infect the Moby Dick, of course. They can't fight with COVID. Simple. Done. Oh, fuck. Does she not feel any guilt? Like anything at all? Like, I really hope she rigged the plan. Because he can drop down? Why is he telling him the answer? 
警備は厳しいかなありがとう全員避難したのならなぜあなたは残っても発明が異国の地に落ちて人々を What an odd reasoning. 機械の体となる前のモビーディックはそのギルドが He's given up on the, on the guild as well. It seems that they keep betraying the guild, all of them. Is Aktagawa about to hit him? Aktagawa, can you just like fuck off respectfully? Like, just get over it. Just take the L. You lost. It's fine. You're a loser. Take the L, you stupid dick. Okay, next episode. My tea almost fell, but it's empty. Haha. <laughs> Simp? He simps for Dazai. I mean, I relate to you on that level. He so badly doesn't want to talk to him, huh? Dude, that would be such a blow on your ego. That's so hurtful! Oh my god, Dazai, respectfully, like, I love you, but that was mean. But also, fuck Octagon, so I get it. What is he talking about? Of cream cheese ought to perish? Is this his way of saying goodbye to everyone? Because he's about to get blown up. Guys, I just realized I'm muted for this entire time. Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> Is he actually gonna pump him up to actually do it? Because I'm I'd be really happy of Ectigo if he actually helps him. Fuck off, dickhead. Literally, shut up. I request for our rankings to be changed. This is the one time that I will ever, ever, ever hype up Aktagawa. Let's go, motherfucker. Let's go, cough syrup. Oh, he's gone. Nice. Good job. That's what's wrong with capitalism, bitch. No, he just simply doesn't care. He doesn't care about the weak, that's the problem. Wait, how does he know? Oh, okay. Never mind, he just answered her. Why? So that's the president of the orphanage, that guy's such a dick. Is Aktagawa gonna finally relate? What did his parents do to him? Is it weird that I find like Aktagawa and Atsushi like complete opposites, even down to their hair color and the way they're designed as people, like they're complete opposites. But see that, that Aktagawa still has some white in his hair to show that he has some part of Atsushi in him, I think. Maybe that's just me overthinking. I don't know. Maybe I'm just being over, over the top. He wants him to have more backbone. Man, every single one of these people is so hellbent on a specific moral. It's ridiculous. Stray dogs. He said the line. They're 
35. How many has he killed? How many has he killed? Then why he jump in here? Thank you! Thank you! Oh my god! Thank you! Thank you! What? Has it not been obvious to you? Because I could tell the moment you met him, my guy. Are you fucking stu- Are you fucking stupid? Are you a fucking stupid, Atsushi? Dumb fucker! I hate him! I don't hate him, but he's pissing me off. Can somebody empty his bank account or some shit? Hey, nouveau riche. He really called him new money. <laughs> That's kind of cool. I just want to know why he wants Dazai's approval so bad. Like he's practically like sucking his dick. Like literally this man is waiting for him to shit and sucking it up with his tongue. Hey, yo! Yes! That's what I'm saying! They're alike, but they're, but they're parallel. He's doing all of this to bring his daughter back? Is it like a resurrection book? <laughs> Became mentally ill. Shit, I was born mentally ill. Damn, Zelda's just like me for real. Is he about to go into the zeros? You all need to join forces like the Transformers. Fucking meow, meow, together. Wee, 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 wee. Not scissor, but I meant like, you know what I'm saying? Wee, you know? The words of your past are not fundamentally unrelated. They're related, but you can move away from them. Take his ass. If I may shed away my burden now. Oh, is that about like relinquishing their traumas over and just letting them go? Stop, that's gonna make me cry. Oh, I don't talk about this on YouTube. I talk this about more of this on my streams and stuff, but obviously I'm a very traumatized individual. So the idea of letting things go and things like that is very close and dear to my heart in ways I can't really explain in a video. So I don't know, that kind of hits me and I'm excited to see them let go of that and stop living by their past and instead live for their future future and their present because there's literally no time like the present, you know? I really wish Akutagawa would go beyond just asking for someone's approval because he's making fun of or he's belittling Tsushi's like thing of wanting to be approved for the will to live. You know, he's saying like, why is he waiting for approval to live from someone else? But then the, you see Akutagawa who wants to know his worth from one person. That's exactly, they're exactly the same. They're just parallels of each other. Like in another alternate world where Atsushi's a bad guy, he's Akutagawa. And where Akutagawa was a good guy, he'd be Atsushi. It's, it's, it's it's a weird parallel. I feel like Dazai accepting Atsushi was kind of like accepting Akutagawa inherently. Like it's a weird, th it's weird. And I think Dazai just wants Akutagawa to accept himself. But y'all, thank you so much for watching today's episodes with me. I can't wait to watch episode 12 and 13. Thank you guys so much for watching and yeah, I'll see you guys next time. Bye bye.